Welcome to an episode of Slime Rancher 2. So let's begin. It should be noted that this is a early access game, so there may be bugs and stuff. I am planning to do the uh, first 30 minutes. I don't think this will be a series. I really wanted to stream it, but for whatever reason that just did not go well. So apologies to anyone who saw a bunch of notifications for streams. Um, it just kept crashing. Um, so I think it's something to do with this game plus my OBS, so I don't know if I'll be able to fix it or not. Let's keep tutorials. We'll keep on the tar. The feral are uh, when slimes are aggressive, and that was in the first game, so I'll go ahead and keep that. Let's just go ahead and play. After a long day of slime ranching, Beatrix LeBeau was enjoying a cool glass of carrot juice as she watched the sunset across the slime sea. Suddenly, a boat arrived at her dock with nothing inside but a mysterious letter. You've explored the far, far range from the dusty shores of the dry reef to the furthest reaches of the perilous glass desert. But there are worlds yet uncharted, Beatrix LeBeau. Rainbow Island awaits you. Climb aboard if you're ready for a new adventure. Beatrix excitedly aborted the boat, and it took her across the slime sea. Eventually, she saw an island unlike anything on the far, far range. Mountains, trees, and grasses all in an array of colors that danced and moved like a dream. I don't think you could pay me to go down to an empty boat that had nothing but a letter on it. <laughs> As she explored, she found an abandoned conservatory overlooking the rest of the island. Seriously, it was equipped for everything a slime rancher like her would ever need for wrangling slime, starting a farm, and building gadgets. Looks so cool. So, and so a new adventure begins. Beatrix tightened her boots and readied her backpack and set out to explore Rainbow Island and uncover its mysteries. I'm glad it all went well for her. But I probably would not be here. <laughs> Let's get moving, as you'd expect. Arrow keys. Not entirely sure if I used to play with a mouse and keyboard or a controller, but this seems kind of right. So sprint and jump. Backpack. We've got ourselves some pink slimes. Let's grab this guy. Uh, shoot them through the barrier. I will. But I think there's one more, maybe? Yeah, there it is. Uh, in the stream that kept crashing. Ooh, and a plort. Um, I managed to get to this point <laughs> before having to give up. So let's shoot them in. Uh, when slimes eat, they make plorts. Head over to the plort market to cash in your plorts. Okay. Here, a chicken. Oh, this place looks so cool. The plort market gives you new bucks for your hard earned plorts. Shoot a plort into the plort market and earn some cash. Uh, here. Nope. I feel like I may, may have swapped these on uh, the original. I'm not sure. Is that all? So here we can see the marketplace. There's an awful lot of empty squares here. A lot of these are recognizable, like the rock, crystal, boom, uh, phosphor, pink, cat, honey. Oop, there's the hunter. God, this looks so cool. How's our- oh, we don't have a jetpack yet. Hello, yeah. Did I get him? I did. Alright. So we've got quite a few plots here. We'll check out the house in a sec. Ooh. Hmm. I wonder what that is. What is this? Ah, Slimepedia. Okay. Tutorials. The different slimes. Resources. Okay. So a place to get info. That's good. I like the, all of the tools here. It looks more lived in, I guess. With all this new clutter. 
So let's stick you in with your friends. Head in here. Sleep. Ah, okay. Hope she's having some food. Good. Uh, all right. So we should probably get them some food. Shoot that guy in. We've got 15 new bucks. What do we have out here? Oh, I should also probably check where those stairs go. Activate. What's it do? Ah, the archery. An expansion to the conservatory set among the ancient ruins and fields of rainbow grass. Uh, certainly can't afford that. But I see. Here's our little barrier. Oh! Alright then. Got ourselves some food. Food like veggies, fruits, and chickens are used to feed the slimes. Try shooting food at pink slimes. They'll eat anything. First I need to explore. It's like something's being constructed. Oh, I like these glowing mushrooms. Nice. Okay. And, uh, oh, some kind of storage. Oh my god, there's so much down here. I wasn't prepared for that. Got land and some storage. What is this? Ah, the fabricator. Oh, this is where we can get like our um, jetpack. We'll need plorts or me bucks. Okay. There's some of the shoes. Uh, refinery. Ah, okay. I should probably leave in case it has uh, hints here. So let's head up back this way and go feed the pink plorts. Uh, no. Pink slimes to get plorts. <laughs> here you guys go. Ooh, the, this thing looks much more bubbly. Does it have a top now? Uh, that about covers the basics. Now it's time to get out there and explore. No matter where your adventure takes you, always keep curiosity and kindness in your heart. Okay, so yeah, there's not a, a roof. It's like, that would be convenient. All right, let's go back down into that. Uh, hold on. Let's get these plorts. Get these guys back out. Okay, now let's go find where those stairs were. Because I imagine they lead down to where we just were. Yes, okay. The fabricator allows you to craft backpack upgrades and gadgets using resources stored in the refinery. Okay. Checked it. The refinery. In order to fabricate fabricate gadgets you'll need to shoot some resources from the refinery. But remember, any resources deposited cannot be removed. Got it. So let's uh, give it some big plorts. There you go. Angler plort. Ah, ringtail. So I guess that's not- oh no, this one is under. So we've got supplies. So that way is the hole. That is the stairs. So what's this way? Seating area. Very nice. Oh, another exit. Ooh. Scary. I cannot wait to have our jump pack. Um, so that'll be somewhere we can explore later. And then I think when we came down through the hole, there were other exits. Yeah. So, ooh, I think that's the one we came down. What's up this way? Another pass to the ocean. Ooh, I got a cool thing on my. It's like a uh, the little gadget we saw at the start. Ooh, I like how the ocean moves in this one. And then there's one other way this way. Where we've got a bunch of pipes. Is there ocean down here? Yeah. Ah, this one leads outside as well. Oh wow. Okay, so where does this go? Ooh, a boat. Okay. So I bet this way leads up to our... Yep. Wow, it's so pretty. I just love all of the new, like, clutter and stuff, so it looks like you could live here. 
The last one was very much you're like here to do a job and that's pretty much all there was to it. This actually looks like a quite a really pleasant place to be. Rainbow field, shifting colors like dreams fading just as quickly. Okay. So we've got a boat down here. Ooh, water. An upgrade. Oh man. We better not see any um uh tars, because we cannot deal with them. Here's the boat that we must have taken. I wonder if we'll find the person who wrote us the letter. Hi guys! Little bouncy buddies. Let's go ahead and grab all of these. It feels so much the same game, but not at all at the same time. Hi! Got these carrots. Oh man, our pack is so small. Oop. Little, little jumpy. The performance isn't uh, perfect yet, but again, early access. Oh, we've got some water here. And I can't get over the ocean. This place is so pretty. Are we going to be able to get home? Not a no idea. <laughs> I think it's uh, that direction. That's kind of all I know. Hey you. Um, I do see a warning over there. Oops. I wonder how many pink slimes we should have. Ooh, hello. Oh, it disappeared. I wonder if that was a like a pink, no, uh, a gold slime. Give me your plate, please. Thank you. All right, we've gotten some food. The slimes that we have. Just need to see if there's anything else out here. Chickens. All right. We don't need these plates. We need a chicken. That's a hen hen. Oh! Goodbye, chicken! We need these things! What are you? A cotton slime. A hop, a skip, and a jump. Oh, it's gone. Alright, so we've got the chickens here. Can I get home this way? It's a good question. I think it's that way. Oh no, is that new? We gotta get rid of you. In case there's new. There's phosphorus! Oh, they look so different. They, they're so much brighter. Excuse me, thank you. This is what's making a noise. Hi! Activate. Oh, it's logs. Well, here we are again. I'm sending the drones out to all their original scouting locations. Once I confirm the conditions are the same, I'll get to work. This place, I still remember being in awe of all these rainbow fields. It felt like being in a beautiful dream. I guess in a way it was, because it ended much too soon. Oh. So there's like a story going on here? So we can only get information from him. This is number nine. Okay. So pretty. Alright, we need more- nope. We need to grab these guys. We probably don't want to stay too long. There are three types of um, slimes here, so tars are a real potential. Oh, I wonder what they look like though. Okay, you can make a tar real quick. Just so I can see. I love the chickens sound the same still. Ah, oh, look at this. Man, as useful as the all the slime combo video was, I am not looking forward to doing another one. <laughs> that was such a pain. But we'll have to see if uh, I can do it again. I'm still trying to decide between doing it during early access, because they'll be adding a bunch of new creatures, I imagine. Um, but I also probably want to get one done at some point. Come on, make a... Make a tar! Ah, there you are. They're a lot more gloopy, it kind of looks like. Alright, time that out though. We don't want to see what they have to do there. I think home... Oh boy. We'll see if I can get home. Is there a map? Oh my god, there is. Um... So I assume that's home. So I was actually right about the direction- Oh, there it is! You could just see it. <laughs> Beautiful. 
The sky is surprisingly blurry, though. Alright, hello, little chicken. Ooh, what's this? Oh, it's Victor! Hello? Hello? Beatrix, do you read me? Dusting, dusting. Hmm. Perhaps you are lost at sea, taken away, by, taken away by a mysterious boat, never to be. Oops. Nope. Just forgot to turn on the display. <laughs> nice to see your face again, Beatrix. I have missed you greatly, my dear friend. And while I am quite excited for you to partake in a new adventure, I already have data that might complicate things. Last night I received a message from some sort of artificial intelligence program. It's writing in code, but not one I recognize. I'm in the process of analyzing it. But I am certain that this message was sent from where you are now. The mysterious Rainbow Island. So to recap, a mysterious boat takes you to a mysterious island and I receive a mysterious coat from the, the said mysterious island. It all seems quite... curious. Well, I've got work to do and you best get exploring. Oh, I almost forgot. Take this home portal. It should make the early stages of your journey easier. Yes, that would have been useful. Take care, Beatrix. We'll be in touch. Aw, that's nice to talk to Victor. Let's see. We're gonna need new locations for these guys. We do have a lot of places. Let's see. I was hoping that down this way was gonna be a dark place to keep our phosphors. But I did not see that here. So we've got this guy, the archway. Uh, let's see, what else do we have that we can unlock? Here's another one. The den. This dark date mushroom covered expansion to the conservatory is refuge from the sun for slimes and ranchers alike. I wonder what this does. Ah. Okay, yeah. Thank you. So we certainly want that. Uh, it was how much? 1,800. Okay. Oh, hey! This must be where we land if we use our home portal. This way is... Woo! My god, I just tried to kill myself. <laughs> I think this is the another uh, entrance to that underground area. Yeah, there's the boat. Okay, and then it's quite a volcano looking thing in that direction. And is this another? No, that's the way we were just... So there's two expansions? Yeah. Okay. So let's look at the map. I cannot. I apparently need to be out of home to look at the map. Let's test. So yeah, I can open it there. I can open it here. I don't know why it wasn't working for a second there. So... This looks like the... Mushroom expansion. Let me go check that. So yes. That direction is the mushroom thing you can uh, open up. So then over here is just a way we can go? No. This is the bridge, or the arches. Is this area. So what's this? Is that where we were? Because we were in the fog. Oh, here's the other one. The gully. Surrounded by tall rock formations and covered in amber grass. And this one looks huge. Like, maybe there's actually two. These are, I guess, what, squares where you can have farms or creatures. Oh, neat. She's not eating this time. She's resting. I like this... So there's like a TV or desk up top. We've got our bed down here, a kitchen to the side. Sleep till morning, please. We can head out. So, hi! Uh, what does this do? We need... We need money. <laughs> so much money. So we've got the roof or the walls. Walls are cheaper. Uh, and then we've got the sh solar shield collector, auto food. Okay. The music box does what? Ah, soothes them. 
Hopefully we don't need that. So I'm going to put over here our rabbits. Yep. Just going to stick those guys in there. I imagine they like these, if I had to take a guess. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Let's try to get these plorts. God, I already miss all of my upgrades. <laughs> Alright, so we will send the plorts in. We don't want to get our phosphorus put out yet. They'll just die um, because of the sun. We'll need quite a bit of money to get um, the walls and everything set up for that. Where did you go? There you are. You guys are all out already. I can only imagine how quick until my rabbits are out. I just love how the wolves look, though. I wonder if this up, like, how often this has new things to communicate to. Nothing yet. So I may just set all of the carrots in here for now so that we don't have storage. And then we'll set these in here and get our pink slimes back in. I know you're disgruntled. There. Uh, and then we should probably collect the um, plorts. I love when these kinds of things have markets where things are worth more or less depending on how much you saturate it. Alright, got some coin. Should go explore some more and see what we could find. It's He said that we had the return home. What kind of... Um, okay. What kind of buttons do we have? So I feel like there used to be a way to, like, build. Gadget mode is T. Aha! And then Q is pulse. But I don't know what that is. But what do we got here? Activate. So we don't have the actual tech. We've just potentially learned how to build it. It's so pretty. I wonder what this is. Upgrade needed to harvest this. Okay. What do we got down here? Ah, the ocean. I bet it would get tiring holding this big uh weapon. Ooh. There's some kind of ruins here. And a light marker, maybe? Yes, I will take these. Not you. I see something in the distance there. That's where I'm heading. Let's pull out some of these carrots so they'll uh, make some plorts for us while we're here. What are you? Ah, so that's how you clear the fog of war, as it were. Okay, so we've got quite the map. I'm curious how much of this is just border of the map and how much of it is actually explorable. But this for sure. Uh, map data acquired. Alright. What is that? That rainbow cabbage? Water lettuce. The only glass of water that has your daily dose of fiber. <laughs> I wonder... Oh, I don't think we can look at that book when we're out and about. Ooh! Refinery links. Refinery... Refinery links conveniently transport resources to the refinery. Oh, hi, buddy. I was so in over my head when I first started here. I remember hauling Jelly Stone back to the conservatory by hand because I was so excited. Breathless and sweating, I was going to about everything all wrong. But I was happy. There's a little time for that now. So I need the, these refinery links so I'm going to be efficient. This time, I'm going to do it right. Man, I wonder who we're learning about here. Ooh, map thing. Can I get to it? Ooh, I don't know. I would need to go... Ah, alright, I'll shoot something in for you. Oh, I have to activate it. I tried to switch uh, these key binds, but I cannot. This is what I want. Do they like carrots? Vegetables, favorites, the lettuce. I was wrong. Okay, so I don't think this is going to lead where we want 
but maybe. Ooh. Head up this way. Oh, cute berries! I don't need you at the moment. Let's get this map marker. Hello, thank you. Okay. Find an area. Grass is so pretty. Gotta go see what that is. And then I probably have to end this. Oh! <laughs> I was trying to walk around this to find it, and then I realized I didn't realize I was walking around the thing I was looking for. Huh. Just a marker, I guess. There's more water. That we cannot collect. What is this? Okay. Interesting. So when you have something attached to the backpack, it just continues to hold it. You don't have to hold the mouse. I don't know if that's how it's always been. Ooh. What's this? Oh yeah, that was the map marker. I don't know if this is something I should take home or if it's something needed for a puzzle piece. <laughs> Maybe I should leave it where I can see it. Right here on the road. Guess we need it at some point. Edited Knox here. And uh, I did end up playing this game again after recording this last night. And I have figured out what that weird silver ball is. It is like a treasure ball. So you huck it at a wall or the ground or something, it'll bust open. It has coins, food, that kind of stuff in it. Uh, in the first game, those were there were crates that did the same thing. Um, but for some reason, when I saw it, all I could think of is either it would be a key to something in a puzzle, like there would be somewhere where I'd stick it, or uh, I could picture it being like the toys you could give the slimes in the first game. So that's why it didn't occur to me to like huck it against something. <laughs> that's why you see me like gently putting it around because I didn't want to lose track of it. So yeah, just pick it up with your backpack and then shoot it against something. It'll bust open and give you supplies. <gasps> it's you! Hi! It's a tabby! And this looks like it's going to be something someday. I just don't know what. Oh, there's home. I was just about to open the map to try to find it. But it's sparkling in the distance. What is that? Can I get up to it? Not without my backpack, I don't- oh, maybe? No, I don't think so. Oh, hey! It's Gordo! How's it going? Let's go ahead and send these in. There we go. And I think that will have to be it for this episode. <laughs> Even the hanging thing's cool. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this first 30 minutes of Slime Rancher 2. I'm very excited that it is now in early access. I played the first one from early access, so I'm very excited to see how this evolves. Um, I might do an all combos video. I don't know. I'll think about it. <laughs> but uh, for now, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. And until next time, hope you have a wonderful day.